the major problem, one problem that we have is how Bob and Alice send their secret key without Eve finding out. Okay, so the dilemma is how do they send their keys without Eve listening? This problem was solved by Whitfield Tiffy, who came up with the Diffie Hellman method and is now one of the most widely used methods for passing secret keys. It is used almost everywhere on the internet in many applications. And with the Diffie Hellman method, the mathematics behind it is that Bob and Alice agree on values G and N. Bob generates a random number. Alice generates another random number. Then Bob does a simple calculation to generate a value A. And Alice does the same. Bob then sends A and Alice sends B. And even though Eve is listening to A and B, it is extremely difficult for her to actually find out what the derived keys are. So in this case, when they do the calculations, key 1 and key 2 should be the same. As an example, we can see here 5 and 4 are the values. Generate 3 and 4. The value of 5 gets generated here, 1 here. They pass those values and they end up with the same key. If we look back here, we should see an example of Diffie-Hellman. Sometimes we can easily overflow a software program. So G and N here, we have Bob generated 3 and Alice 3. We have values 59 and the keys are the same. Unfortunately, Bob and Alice have chosen the same random value. So we'll generate another one. In this case, 10 and 8. Calculate A and B. 12 and 14 and hopefully at the end of it the keys should be the same. So Diffie-Hellman allows us to be able to generate a secret key without uh, and communicate openly without Eve finding out. Unfortunately Diffie-Hellman suffers from the great man in the middle attack or Eve in the middle. In this case she can negotiate one key here and another key here and as far as Bob and Alice can tell they are negotiating with each other. Another example might be in what's called DNS poisoning. In this way Eve poisons the DNS server so that instead of communicating with Alice which is the eBay server here Eve poisons it so that the communication actually happens with uh, another server.